Dirk's family enlists some friends for a great cause, and we all keep praying for Randy. Find out all that and more in this week's episode of Twinks. Welcome to Twinks. I'm Stephanie from GodCountryOnline.com, bringing you a rundown of this week's top headlines in country music. Country music fans locked up ticketing servers Friday morning to purchase their tickets to Dirk Bentley Country Cares concert to benefit the Granite Mountain Hot Shots. The now sold out event will take place July 22nd in Arizona. Along with Dirks, the band Harry, David Neal, and Randy Hauser have signed on to join to help raise money for the families of the 19 firefighters who lost their lives in last week's wildfires. Jake Owen had an eventful July 4th weekend after a trip to the emergency room. Jake tweeted a picture of himself in the ER with a neck brace after sharing that he got into just a little go-kart accident with two of his NASCAR buddies. Looks as though the accident was more serious than we all thought. Tuesday morning, Jake tweeted, headed into surgery. I was trying to avoid it, but since I play guitar for a living, I need to get this done. Followed by, by the way, there's no way I missed the chance to play country concert or Fenway Park this weekend. I won't let y'all down. And he sure didn't. Jake showed up at Fenway where he was playing with Jason Aldean, sling and all. The country music community and fans have been praying all week for Randy Travis. On Sunday, Randy was admitted to a Texas hospital and listed in critical condition. Randy suffered from complications from a recent acquired viral cardiomyopathy. Although cardiomyopathy is often not curable, there are many treatment alternatives that can effectively control the symptoms for improved quality of life. The treatment choice is largely based on the cause and the type, as well as the extent of the damage to the heart muscle. On Wednesday night, Randy suffered from a stroke and went into emergency surgery to relieve the pressure on his brain. Our latest update from his rep came yesterday saying that Randy is heavily sedated and is still listed in critical condition. Our thoughts and prayers are with Randy and his family during this difficult time. Well, that wraps it up for this week's top headlines. For more news, head over to GotCountryOnline.com and our partner site, CountrySongsOnline.com. Remember to follow us on Twitter at GotCountry, on Facebook, and here on YouTube, and we'll see you next week.